In this video, we'll develop and use the formula for finding how many diagonals can be drawn for any polygon. A diagonal of a polygon is a line segment between two non-adjacent vertices of the polygon. So our question that we want to answer is how many diagonals can be drawn in any n-sided polygon? To answer this question, we'll look at a pattern. First, let's look at four-sided polygon. Let's draw our diagonals. Notice that we can only draw one diagonal from this vertex because the other ones are sides. So we have four sides and one diagonal from each vertex. So we have one from this vertex and then one from this vertex. And then if we wanted to go from this vertex, we would duplicate our diagonal. And also from this one, we would duplicate. So we have two diagonals here. But now we can... Uh, to get our pattern, uh, we'll need to notice that we have 4 minus 3. So that gives us our one diagonal from each vertex. And there's four vertices. But then to keep from duplicating, we have to divide by 2. So this is going to help us get our formula. So let's see if that works for five sides. For five sides, we have one diagonal from this vertex and then another one from that vertex. So there's our number of sides, which is five, minus three. That gives us our two diagonals from this vertex. And we're going to have two from this vertex. And then we duplicate here. So we only have this one. And from this one, we would already duplicate those and already duplicate these. So we had five only divided by two. Let's see if this gives us we have one, two, three, four, five diagonals. If we do the math here, five minus three is two, and those twos cancel, so we would get five diagonals. So for six sides, I want six minus three times the number of vertices, which is 6, and then divide by 2. So when I do the math here, I have 6 times 3 is 18 divided by 2. I should get 9 diagonals. Let's see if we do. So 1, 2, 3, 4, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then these are all duplicated, and these are all duplicated. So, yes. So for seven signs, I should have seven minus three, times 7, that's the number of vertices, divided by 2 to keep from duplicating. So um, 7 minus 3 is 4. 7 times 4 is 28, divided by 2 is 14. So let's count and see if we do have 14, just to make sure. 1, 2, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So our total number of diagonals in an insided polygon. is equal to, can be a fraction, we need to look at what stays the same. So in all of these we have a 2 in the denominator, and in the parentheses we're subtracting 3 each time. The 7 here is the number of signs, the 6 here is the number of signs, 5 here for the number of signs. So we need n minus 3 times n. So our formula that we need to use is n times n minus 3 divided by 2. So let's use that formula to find the total number of diagonals that can be drawn in a dodecagon. Now a dodecagon we know is 12 sides, so n is equal to 12. So our diagonals then, remember we said it was n times n minus 3 divided by 2. So we just need to sub in 12 for n. If we do that, we have 12 times 12 minus 3 divided by 2. So this is 12 times 9 divided by 2. And I'm going to simplify here, and we have 6 times 9, which is 54. 